Hi guys, it's Ksenia. Welcome back to my channel. So this may be one of the weirdest, but also probably my favorite video that I've ever done on my channel because today I'm gonna be eating. I know that sounds super, super weird and it's even weirder than I'm filming this taste test video in front of my perfumes. So I'm actually really annoyed right now because I filmed this entire video and something is happening to my camera. As you can tell by the quality change, I'm filming currently on my phone, which I've actually had a lot of you guys tell me that you actually like this quality better. So maybe this is for the best right now, but something is happening to my camera. I don't know what, but the audio is just off. I don't know what I've done to it, but I went to go and edit the clips and it was just super light noisy, like muffled. You could barely hear me and I'm not super techy. So I was trying to kind of correct that on Final Cut Pro, but I, I don't know how to do any of that stuff. So unfortunately, I'm gonna have to refilm this video, which would be no problem. I mean, it's always super annoying having to refilm videos, but it's kind of tricky to refilm this video because this was supposed to be like a first impression taste test. And yeah, I already got it through that video. I'll show you guys some clips of when I first opened this box. It looked a lot pretty than it does right now because everything is already open and i've tried everything but i'm just gonna retry everything for you guys and pretend like it's the first time i'll give you guys like my little ratings on them but basically today i'm gonna be trying treats by try treats they are a monthly subscription company every single month they will send you a box just like this one this looks horrible right now because i've already opened everything so super annoying but I, like i said i'll show you the clip of when it was pretty and everything was unopened but this is what the box looks like and it's going to be filled with treats from all over the world so each month has its own theme so i had no idea what i was getting when i got this box they just reached out to me wanting me to send me something so that i could try out for a video and of course i said yes because one thing that i am is a snacker i am like the biggest snacker in the world and they kindly sent me a code so that i could share with you guys if you are interested in trying these out you can use my code xenia for 15 percent off of your first month's box so definitely take advantage of that because i feel like this is just a cool and fun way to try new treats from all of the world and a quick little disclaimer that i made the first time I filmed this video, uh, but I'm gonna make it again. I am a super picky person when it comes to food and something that I hate is when people get annoyed when you say that you don't like something that they like. Excuse me, you can go ahead and eat your raw chicken over there. Just cause I don't like it doesn't mean anything. I just, I find it so annoying when you tell people you don't like something that they like and they just look at you like you're a freaking alien, like. I like what I like, okay? You eat your little raw chicken over there. Anyways, I'm saying that because I don't want to come off offensive if I don't like anything in this video. It's not me disrespecting the culture or anything, obviously. Like, obviously we all know this, but some people need these little disclaimers because they'll just find a way to pick at everything. You know what I'm saying? Anyways, with all that said, before we get into this video, please make sure that you're subscribed to my channel and turn your post notifications on and let's get started. So I had no idea which country this box was gonna be themed as. So when I opened the box, I was super surprised to see that it was a South Korean box. So these are all South Korean snacks. And in your little box, you'll find a little like postcard type of looking thing. And it'll tell you like a little bit of a description about the snacks that you're getting. And then it comes with a full little rundown list of everything you got in your box, what their names are, a little bit of a description about everything. I wonder if they have treats from Albania. Try treats if you're watching this video. If you have treats from Albania or Greece, please send me that box. I'm gonna just start in the same order that I did the first video that I did, but some of these come with doubles. So let's start off with this guy right here. So this is Toasted Seaweed by Sanjuga Jim. And it says that is a traditional Korean snack made from seaweed, obviously. Crunchy in texture and savory in taste. Now, I have never liked seaweed, so I already knew going into this that I was not gonna like this. People claim that seaweed is not fishy. I have no idea how they don't think it's fishy because to me, seaweed is super fishy. So this, as you can tell the first time that I tried this, look at the bite that I took off of it, like the tiniest little bite and I did not like it, but I will try it again for you guys. I will torture myself just for you guys. Oh, no. Oh. I do not like seaweed. It is not my snack, okay? Like, it is way too fishy for my taste. I'm gonna rate all of these, so for that, I will give that a one out of 10, just because I've never liked seaweed, okay? I just, I don't like fishy type of scents. 
not for me. A lot of these snacks are by the same brand, which is this Lottie brand. I'll put it up on the screen, the name. So a lot of these more dessert type of snacks are from this Lottie brand. So the first one that I'm going to try is this custard little cake. This came with two. I had actually already eaten the first one. This is delicious. It's like a little cake with like a sweet custard. Oh my god, I didn't even say it. I'm like so excited to eat this that I didn't even say what it's called. This is a custard cake. It is moist and fluffy cake with delicious custard cream filling that melts in your mouth. And that it does. I'm going to be talking with my mouth full throughout most of this video. If you don't like, like eating sounds, don't watch this video. I give this an 8 out of 10. I really, really like it. But... I'm just waiting for something better and there is something better and now I can tell you that <laughs> because I've already filmed this video. Let's move on to the next thing. Next are these. I'm glad that there's doubles in this box so that I can at least show you what it looks like unopened. But I already opened it the first time around. These are these little choco pie. It's by this same Lottie brand and it's basically a biscuit layered with chocolate and marshmallow. Now if you follow my channel you know that not only do I love the smell of marshmallow in my perfumes. But I love the taste of marshmallow. I love this because it reminds me so much of an Albanian snack that we have that is very similar to this. It's like cake and then the marshmallow like gooey filling on the inside. Mm. That's amazing. I also give this an 8 out of 10. Next is these little things which I had no idea what they were but I guess the sort of pictures on it kind of give it away. One thing I'll say about these I love the packaging of all these snacks. Like, everything is so fun and colorful. Like, I'm obsessed. This is called Chick Choc. It is a premier chocolate chip cookie, soft in texture, and is made with real chocolate chips. So, it's basically like a little chocolate chip cookie. As you can see, I already bit into it. But, it's delicious. To be honest, I'm not that into chocolate, chocolate chip cookies regularly. Like, I'm not the biggest, like, cookie fan or like chocolatey snacks like if i'm gonna have a sweet snack it's gonna be like a gummy bear like i, I like more like fruit flavored snacks type of thing rather than like chocolate bars or like dessert type of thing i don't know i don't know if that makes any sense i'm gonna give that a 7 out of 10 it's really good but i just prefer something else like it's a little like basic i guess then there's these so these are again by lottie um or latte i don't know this is a butter coconut biscuit it is a crunchy delectable cookie that may catch you off guard it has a unique taste of buttery palate with a hint of coconut i gave these a 9 out of 10 because although they seem like just a boring little biscuit they remind me so much of these little biscuits that we have in albania that look exactly like this pretty much but what is really like just bringing back nostalgia for me is Mm. it's so good and like buttery to be honest i don't really taste the coconut in it like if it's there it's like very very faint but this reminds me of like growing up when i used to live in albania like my childhood growing up and i was at my grandparents house i used to make turkish coffee for them and we would like sit down in the balcony and like enjoy it and we had these little biscuits out and we would dunk these in the coffee or like milk and for that reason and like just the nostalgia that this is giving me i i'm giving this a high 9 out of 10 okay like they may look a little boring but i love these mm. and you better believe after this video i'm gonna get a glass of milk and enjoy the rest of these next are these this is called cereal oat now this is apparently a cereal so i'm assuming you like eat this with milk to like fully enjoy it basically they are a chocolate snack cereal with a great mix of roasted oats and luscious chocolate it contains healthy calcium fortified oats and it is convenient bite size so i don't know if like if there's any koreans out there watching this video and you have tried these are these meant to like be eaten as like cereal like in milk or do you just like enjoy these you know as you would it's basically like a little cookie and it has some chocolate in the inside it's nothing to write home about like they're okay i can definitely taste that like oat sort of 
outside um like the crunchy oat flavor i can taste it i'm not the biggest fan of that next are these right here they are margaret cookie by lottie it's a cookie with french butter and peanut filling they're like crumbling in my fingers right now but it looks like this it looks really yummy but to be honest like it's good but i've just never been into like peanut flavor things like you know the Reese's peanut butter cups that everyone's obsessed with I've never really cared for those like I'm just not a big fan of like peanut butter type of snacks so I would give that like a six out of ten like it's good but it's just not something that I would like go out and grab next are these now this is not the first time that I've tried these because I had tried these before I'm pretty sure that they're at the world market I'm pretty sure that's where I've gotten them before but they are Choco Boy and they kind of remind me of like the same flavor as like the little panda cookies what are they called i don't remember the exact name of those little panda cookies but those are some of my favorite snacks ever i get them all the time and it also kind of reminds me of pocky which i also really really love they're very similar to those types of snacks and i can't really try these because i guess on my way to me they all kind of melted and they're all kind of clumped up together so it's kind of hard to just pick one. Oh, okay there we go they don't look like this <laughs> they look a lot cuter when they're not melted but Mm. these are amazing like i'm not even that into like chocolatey snacks but that's like an elite chocolate snack everything just tastes so good in it so i would give that a 9 out of 10 because that's a chocolatey snack that i am definitely down for these last two snacks i saved for last time in the first time that i filmed this video because i'm the most excited about these first of all the packaging of this is so so freaking cute like this whole pink vibe that it has when i first opened this box this was the first thing that caught my attention and i was like i need to try that this is strawberry corn puffs by cosmos they are a crunchy rice puff in a chocolate flavor like strawberry chocolate they have a similar texture to cheetos but instead of the cheesy delights of cheetos you will experience a unique taste of chocolate and that you will these are delicious they look like this and yeah it's basically exactly what it sounds like it's like a corn puff but with strawberry flavor they're so good i don't know what they remind me of like i feel like it's a familiar taste but i can't quite pinpoint it but they are so good you can definitely taste like the strawberry flavor that it has and I feel like when you first eat it, you kind of would expect it to be like savory. So it kind of is a bit of a mind F because then it just turns like strawberry and sweet, but it's so, so, so good. So for me, this is a 10 out of 10. I love that. And then the last snack, this is the snack that I was most excited for in this entire box. And I'm so mad right now that I can't show you. Well, I'll put in a clip of what I did to this, but basically the way that it looked like I thought when I first got this, that it was ramen because it was like a whole bar of like ramen so i thought that i had to like go and cook this but this is actually meant to be eaten raw and it comes with like a little sauce packet which i've already opened and basically the way you do this is you first kind of smash up the ramen and you just kind of break it off into smaller little chunks like that and you put all the little spices that are in here in it then you kind of close it and shake the bag to kind of disperse all the spice and it basically tastes like chips like they look like this but this is so good. It's like chips, but with this delicious flavor. It is super spicy, though. <laughs> like, like, hella spicy. But it's so good. It tastes exactly like uncooked ramen, because that's kind of what it is. But the noodles are like, I don't know, they're different than like ramen noodles. Because if you were to bite into like a whole thing of like actual ramen noodles, it'd be kind of hard to chew. With this one, they're like actually like chewy it's like crunchy like like a chip would be but the flavor of that powder is so potent and so good this is called pushu pushu it's a crispy and rich noodle snack topped with chicken flavored powder that's super spicy might add, i add this ramen was made to enjoy raw just as you've seen it in squid game i feel like i don't remember seeing this in squid game but i watched squid game a long time ago so i don't know but i love that that's a 10 out of 10.
I'm probably just gonna like edit this video and just sit here and finish the rest of that. That is it for this video. I know it was super, super random, but I had to try these. Like, when they reached out to me, I was so happy and I was like, yes, immediately, yes. But I'm pretty sure I've seen these before and I feel like people used to do videos with these types of snack types things like a long time ago. And I used to love watching like snack taste test type of videos. So highly recommend you try out trytreats.com. If you're interested, make sure to use my code Xenia for 15% off of your first box. Let me know which country you get or let me know if you guys have tried these before because I just love the concept of it. Like I just love trying new snacks and this is just a perfect way to do so. That is it for this video. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.